Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. FG Normal sent me some more diamond paintings to show you guys on my channel. So thank you very much to FG Normal for sending these to me. Let's get into it. There's a number of them in here. We'll do this one first. So there are six of them in here. <laughs> but I don't think they should take too long. Hopefully I can get this back in this bag. These are a little bit trickier than them white envelopes or whatever you would call them. So this is a special drill. Let me zoom you in just a little. Okay, it's not pretty. So it is a partial special drill. We have kind of our clock with the butterflies around. And there are 12 symbols on here. We do have the number, the symbol, DMC code, which, yeah, special care, or special characters, special uh, drills or rhinestones whatever you want to call them i don't know how they come up with the dmc codes <laughs> i've never compared them to other kits that have dmc codes for their special drills so i'll have to see if they're the same <laughs> but that is so pretty so this one would not take long at all to do 30 by 30 and Symbols look nice and clear. Even these teeny tiny little twelves, I can read very easily. So it looks like we have a lot of little rhinestones that are going to go in here. So let's take a look at the drills or diamonds. Do you get a standard toolkit? This one does come with. Um, the plastic tweezers, which do come in handy sometimes for placing the larger special drills down. I typically use my metal ones. I like the metal tweezers better than them plastic ones, but maybe them plastic ones would not scratch the special drills. I don't know. I've never had a problem with that, but... All right, love looking at the special drill diamond paintings. Let's look at them this way. And I'll zoom you in. Okay, here we have our pretty yellow rhinestones. We have some black standard round drills. Red. Oh, look at that beautiful turquoise. Love it. They're pretty purple. Oh, and a brighter purple and a real pale one. Oh my gosh, that's going to be pretty. If you can see it through the glare, sorry about that. And we have some yellow hearts. I don't think I've ever had those before. That's cute. And that'll be going, you know, right in through here. That'll look cute. We have some green rhinestones. Some really pale pink marquee. No, teardrops. Some iridescent silver rounds. And then those little beauty pink rhinestones. Oh, that'll look pretty with the purples. So we have some, you know, bigger purple butterflies, but then we have a little bitty pink one up here, and then kind of one peeking out behind the clock. So that's going to be cute. I think that bright pink is going to be in here too. Ah, pretty. So this would be a really nice one to do in between doing a large diamond painting. And I do like doing that periodically, just to give myself a break 
from a large one. And plus I can sit downstairs in my comfy chair in the living room uh, rather than upstairs in my diamond painting room, um, which is not quite as comfortable. Get this one packaged back up. Now, like I said, we'll see if I can get this back in this little plastic sleeve. And if I struggle too much, I'll do it off camera. I think I'll get it except for this glue. There we go. All right. I did it. Okay, so the thumbnail. Because I always like to put a thumbnail on them. Is this one. So that is what it will look like. My tape out. Oh no, I'm out of tape. I'm gonna have to pause and go get another roll. <laughs> so I'll be right back. Okay, I think I'm ready to go. Well, let's put them up here. All right, number two. Looks like a little bit of a bigger one. Oh yeah. Am I zoomed out far enough? No, I don't think so. Now my birthday is in August. And they have one of these coffee cups for every month of the year. So, you know, if you would want to collect all of them or if you just want one for your birthday month, this one says cool off with watermelon and then it has the month down the side. Look at all this white. <laughs> I think I'll be doing some multi-placing in this one. So for this one there's a lot of block drilling um, and that just means you have a lot of the same color within that area. So you don't have a whole bunch of different colors within one small area. That is what we call confetti. <laughs> I am not a confetti person. Some people absolutely love it and they don't like the black drilling. Um, I'm kind of a fan of this. It just, it goes so much faster. But again, the symbols are very clear. Even here where they have the white lettering, very easy to read. And yeah, this is all D's with a few N's in here um, that, yeah, they're a brighter white. So you can, I can pick them out really easily. Oh yeah, this will be an easy, fast one to do. There are 20 colors in this diamond painting and it is a 40 by 40. And as usual, we have the number, the symbol, and the DMC code, upper left, lower right. Oh, this is cute. So August, of course, being prime summertime, I have the watermelon. I don't know, I didn't even look to see what the other months, um, you know, what the picture was. But yeah, that's cute. All right, so let's look at the drills. Wow, we have a big, long package. <laughs> Usually they're not quite this long. I'll have to remember that when I package these back up. And we have lots of white, as you can imagine. All right. And... We'll start with the white. So we have, these are full packs too. One, two, three, four, 
five packs of white. <laughs> yeah, definitely multi-placing. So if I didn't say it, this is a full round. And another white. <laughs> As if those weren't enough. And we have, oh, these two colors together are pretty. Oh, those three. Beautiful. And we have a tan. Pretty mint green. A little bit of brown. We have a couple of sage colors. A couple of greens. I'm assuming that's going to be on the wording. Bottom of the cup. Tan. Big pack of red. And some beautiful pink. I love that shade of pink. And a dark pink. Some gray. Some more red. Dark gray. Kind of a two brick red. Well, it's a, just a darker red. Yeah, that's going to be so cute. So I'm going to put this one on the side. <laughs> I would like to get this one done sometime this summer. Zoom back out. I have a little bit of lag here on uh, my iPad that I look at uh, when I am doing my videos. So it's kind of hard to tell if I'm actually zoomed out enough or not. Or when I zoom in. It's like I have to wait for it to catch up with me. All right. So, yeah. Would be kind of neat to collect all the months, wouldn't it? Just like I know some people um, with Diamond Art Club, they have all the Zodiac symbols. And some collect all the Zodiacs. And those are big diamond paintings. So I cannot imagine where the heck a person would put all that. But a lot of the diamond paintings we just do just for the sake of doing them. You know, we don't actually display them all. A lot of mine are in a portfolio under my bed. There are some I want to frame yet, though. Get in there. And uh, get up on my wall. The big handle lid I'm working on right now upstairs, I definitely want to hang up. Almost forgot to put the thumbnail on. So that's the thumbnail. Isn't that cute? Oh, I didn't even notice the little hearts. <laughs> that's cute. All right. Now that I have tape. I was wondering when that roll of tape was going to run out because, boy, I did a lot of videos <laughs> with uh, that one roll of tape. And number three, oh, this is a bigger one too. This might even be a 40 by 50. And, oh yeah, we have our dog, or maybe it's a wolf, looking up in the sky. We have the sunset. And the painting on here doesn't do it justice. I'll uh, zoom you in. I'll show you the thumbnail now. And we'll see how close the colors in here are going to be according to the drills. But that gives you a much better idea of what it will look like when it's done. Because the, the coloring on the canvas is not always real accurate, you know of what it's going to look like. And that's why I like showing the drills. It gives you a much better idea of the colors that are going to go into the diamond painting. So this is a 40 by 5 by 45. There are 20 colors in here. 
and of course the number, the symbol, the DMC code, upper left, lower right. As far as confetti, we do have some block drilling. There is quite a bit of confetti. Some more block drilling here and here, but yeah, all up here, here, down here, a lot of confetti. So if you're not a confetti person, <laughs> I kind of like a combination of both. It's just the confetti takes me so much longer because I always invariably miss <laughs> some of the symbols. So I always have to go back, you know, get out that color again and fill it back in. So that's the one problem I have with confetti. I don't think I'm alone in that one. My eye, for some reason, just skips right over things. I have the same problem with color by number pictures. Again, if you don't like this crinkle noise, please mute or skip ahead until you see that I am done opening these. All right. So, right off the bat, we had this little baby caboose. <laughs> we have some off-white. Oh, and that pretty deep, kind of reddish pink. That's pretty. Let's look at all the other colors. Lots of black, I see that. We have a dark red. Kind of a peachy pink. Very dark purple. Oh, that is pretty. Do we have the DMC codes on here? Nope. Just the number and then the um, code for this particular diamond painting. And I do want to point out, if you're not real familiar with diamond paintings, um, some people like to store their canvases separate from the drills or diamonds. There's always a code on the diamonds that will correspond with, let me, let me bring it down. So this says Y1505. You will always have a code on the top of the canvas that will correspond to the number on the diamond. So you can match them up later. Just thought I would point that out. Okay, then we have our black. And we have one, two, three blacks. Not too bad. Yeah, let's flip it over. You can see the colors better. We have gray. Oh, look at that pretty red-orange. Kind of tan, another gray. Dark red. That's pretty. Oh, look at that bright pink. Love it. Kind of a dark brown, real dark green. Oh, look at that, like a magenta. That is pretty. Peach, another green. Love that color too. Kind of a, I don't know, what do you call that? It's not a mauve. Hmm. And a light blue. Oh, that is pretty. I don't get, you know, order a lot of animal pictures. Um, but I just thought this one was so pretty. And then again, this is what it will look like. So it is going to be much brighter than what is painted on the canvas. As you can see, it is going to be resemble this here, the thumbnail much closer. So yeah, that is going to be gorgeous. The colors in these flowers are so pretty. Ooh. Okay, zoom back out and we'll get this one put back. Now, how long is this package? This one. Yeah, I think I can fit that in there. Jack Blue. Oh, 
that struggle is real. <laughs> I knew a lot of these diamond painting companies, the all of the diamond paintings were going to be coming in around the same time. So this past week I had three of them up. Now I have two that I'm going to be recording today. And I had one more come in the mail today. So I have this one and two more to record so you'll be getting lots of diamond painting videos plus i have a number of diamond art clubs to unbox that have been sitting there forever just haven't been able to get around to them all right let's go on to number four oh and this is in a Separate. No, it's not. I lie. And we have our kitty. Look at the colors in that. Um, I unbagged or I shown you another very similar picture to this uh, last week, but it was in realistic colors. This one is in unrealistic colors, and I just thought it was so pretty. Look at all those rainbow colors. These green eyes. Oh, there are 24 colors in here. This is a 40 by 30 because it is a landscape picture. Number, symbol, DMC code. Let me look at the symbols quick. Yes, they look just fine, even in the dark areas. You know I always like to look <laughs> in the dark areas a lot of times. If there's going to be a problem, that's where it will be. Now this one, again, lots of confetti. Um, except for the background here, you do have, you know, some areas where you're going to have spots of color, but a lot of black in the background. This is pretty much black. You know, there's just blues and black. So this is black, but the cats, the cat and the kitten, a lot of confetti. Yeah. But it's so cute. So this is the thumbnail and it's backwards in here oh I know why when I did this and I make it a smaller size if I zoom up too fast it flips the picture and I didn't notice it but you get the idea all right so we shall look at the drills oh and this one's pre-kitted so they're already in a little biggie. So if you're not a fan of kitting up into separate containers, when they're pre-kitted up like this into separate baggies, you don't have to. You can just start diamond painting right away. Me, myself, I like kitting up. <laughs> not as big of a fan. Down, not down kitting. Kitting down, I guess. And uh, putting my spare drills into storage. But kidding up is just fun. <laughs> it's the anticipation of doing the diamond painting, I think. All right. Let's look at the drills. Now I'm assuming, yeah, these are in order, but of course they won't be when I put them back. So we have kind of a pinkish red, dark brown. Yeah, going to be out of order anyhow, so we'll start from here. We have a tan. Oh, pretty purple. I imagine we're going to have every color of the rainbow in here. Kind of a mauve bunch of this blue. Earth tone. Kind of a rusty brown. Some green. Oh, that's pretty. Oh my gosh. Look at that dark teal. Oh, I love it. That's pretty. Pink. It's 
kind of a tannish uh, orange, kind of a real pale peach. Gray blue, another green, oh, that pretty dark pink. Some more green. Oh, and another shade of teal. And these are big bags, so I bet you these are going to be in the background. Some more blue. Light gray. Light orange. Darker gray. Oh, a lilac color. Another gray. So lots of shades of gray in here. And then a big bag of black. I actually thought there would be more than this. Hmm. Interesting. All right. So. Oh, yeah. I already showed you the thumbnail. <laughs> All right. Let me quickly get this packaged back up. These are actually easier to get back in the package than those that are attached. <laughs> They're a little bit less noisy too because this type of plastic doesn't make all that crinkle noise that some of you hate and some of you love. ASMR for those of you who like that. And that didn't work too well because I didn't get it in the bag. <laughs> oh my goodness. I thought the bag had ripped. No, it was just me. Just me. Okay. Now that I made a total mess. Doesn't matter as long as it fits in the bag. Let me zoom you back out a little more. All right, on to number five. Feels like a smaller one. Oh yeah, another kitty. <laughs> Can you tell what I like? So I guess I do show animal ones, but a lot of times they're cats. So this is just a small 30 by 30. Darn, I always forget when I get a phone call in the middle that it stops recording and I couldn't get it to record again. So I'm really not sure where that <laughs> stopped. But I think I was talking about the confetti. Um, and we were just about to look at the drills. Hope that's where we were. <laughs> yeah, and I had it on Do Not Disturb. So hmm, I'm not sure why that happened. Let zoom in. So we have some white, pretty sky blue. Get our big long train out here. Oh, look at that pretty pale pink. Ooh, dark blue gray. Ah, oh, look at that lilac, lavender, I guess. Dark, dark brown. Two big packs of this lavender. Oh, that's pretty. Darker purple. Spring green. Oh, that's going to be the eyes. Oh, gosh, that's going to be pretty. Boy, that's going to just pop. Oh, and a lot of shades of blue. Watch. Oh, my gosh. What a gradient of blue. That's pretty. And then a real dark blue, too. Some green. Oh, and two shades of mint green. Oh, another big pack of a darker lavender. Real light, like a blue-gray. Oh, that real pale mint green. And this gorgeous purple. 
So yes, lots of purples and especially blues. Oh, that kitty's going to be so colorful. Here is the thumbnail. <laughs> I like the fluff coming up off his ears. <laughs> Cute. Let's zoom out. And we have one left. Let's see how long this is. Not too long. Okay, let's try that. Oh well, it should fit in the, like I said before, that's the nice thing about these white envelopes or whatever you want to call them. It's easy to fit these back in. <laughs> Especially when they're real small diamond paintings like this. Oh no! I'm just gonna tuck it in there. <laughs> get in there! What did I say about easy getting it back in? Let's try the other side. Well see there's always a lip in here. So it's, yeah, <laughs> sometimes it's, it's hard to get around that. Oh my gosh, the struggle is real again, because, yeah, it keeps hitting that. Let's try it on this side. Wow. Never again am I going to say it's easy getting them in there. This was a smaller um, white package. So oh, that's why. This one is nice and loose, so it'll be easy to get in there. Knock on wood. So our last one, oh yeah, is my initial. Isn't that cute? We have all this Lily of the Valley. This is a 30 by 30. So again, I thought this would be so cute to do and put in the scrapbook. And there are only 17 colors in this one. Number symbol DMC code. And this one is a lot of block drilling. Uh, very little confetti at all. Little bit in through here in, in the leaves. There's a little bit. Down here, there's two different colors. So, but, you know, with only the two colors, you wouldn't be missing, you know, colors like I always do. Um, so, a little bit of confetti. Not much at all. And again, symbols nice and clear. Looks like the background's going to be a dark blue. Yep, 939. That real dark, dark blue that looks black, <laughs> but it's not. It's a black imposter. And this one again is kitted up for you in the babies. And again, I like these babies who, that have that great big number on because you can reuse these. They're not the thickest of babies though. Um, so I don't know how many times you could reuse them, but yeah. So let's flip them over and zoom you in. All right, so we have this, oh, real deep plum. Kind of a light olive gray. Oh, look at that pretty yellow. Darker olive, army green maybe. Real dark forest green. Another green, brown, another gray. Lots of grays. Dark blue, another dark green. A lot of dark greens. 
here we go. <laughs> this is the 939. Wow. This is, oh my gosh, this is a full square. Ooh. But, yeah, a lot more multi-placing. And I don't have a problem with the squares, so. And this one, because it's my initial, this one won't ever be part of the mystery packages that I do periodically. So we have another green, pretty yellow, orange, and some white for the Lily of the Valley. So yeah, I will be getting together some mystery boxes again. So stay tuned to my color and chats. Um, where I will be announcing that. I would think sometime uh, within the next few weeks I am going to be giving away some mystery boxes. If you're not familiar with that, it's I get 10 diamond paintings together, um, which fit in a medium size flat rate USPS box. And all you do is pay the postage, and you get 10 diamond paintings. All right, that is our last one from FG Normal. And again, thank you to FG Normal for sending these to me. Oh, this is the thumbnail. I like that lily of the valley. Oh, that was kind of blurry, wasn't it? Sorry. <laughs> I don't have autofocus on, so. All right, so we have the, let me zoom you back out. We have the initial, a gorgeous purple kitty. And the rainbow, mama kitty and baby. The August mug. The wolf and the sunset. Can't even see these all, can you? and our special drill and as usual i will leave a link to fg normal's website down below in the description and i will include direct links to all six of these diamond paintings if you are interested in any of them so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed this unbaking of these diamond paintings if you did please hit that thumbs up button subscribe if you're new to my channel i hope everybody's having a great day and as always happy coloring and happy diamond painting Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.